with image generation tools taking over the internet and making prompts to image an everyday business, and with everyone now having the flexibility to imagine and convert their thoughts into prompts which essentially brings about interesting visuals that we probably may have never dreamt of, this in itself has escalated the rate at which images are made. And with tools like this, it's only a matter of time when stylized videos will become a thing, as it's already here. You see, sometime in 2021, the folks at Runway ML Research made the latent diffusion, which was an AI system that could generate realistic images using an improved image generation technique. And then, in 2022, Stable Diffusion was announced and released, and this in itself was an improved diffusion model and this took the world by storm, making everyone an image creator and we've seen a massive adoption of this across different creative industry. And today, Runway is announcing the next step forward in image generation. Introducing Gen 1. Gen 1 is an image generation system that can efficiently generate a video in any style while retaining quality and flexibility, with a consistent and efficient mode of applying a style or a text prompt to a given image. And this new approach has now been dubbed video to video. Now, this isn't the first time that we're seeing video generation or video altering, as this has been done over the years. So, sometime in early 2019, we got the chance to see and explore Epsynth. Epsynth was an amazing tool to work with, and at the time, and also currently, this awesome video altering tool takes a look at image references as style generation for the video. But what makes Runway ML a step ahead is this. The styles to run these videos can be generated or assigned by choice and not necessarily sketched to match a given set of frames or references like we have in the case of Epsynth. And this new video to video could make creating stylized videos super easy. And currently, they do have a few early use cases. The stylization mode, the storyboard mode, which simply turns mockups into fully animated renders, a masking mode that allows users to isolate subjects and modify them with a prompt. There's also the render mode that turns object renders into realistic output by applying an input image or prompt. And finally, there is the customization mode, which uses Gen 1 to customize the model for high fidelity results. And with recent AI implementation making their ways into various tools for image and also material creation, just like we talked about a few days ago, Gen 1 for sure is definitely going to take its own turn, as it's only a matter of time for stylized videos to become a form of entertainment or possibly carve a niche for itself. So, for those who would like to take a look at this, and probably you would love to join the early access, then you can simply go over to the link in the description that will bring you right here where you can fill up the form and get notified when this becomes available. And for those who also like to try out Epsynth, probably you would like to explore this for yourself and see how you can push the bounds of this. This is currently available for both Windows and Mac and links to that alongside how you can use Stable Diffusion to generate materials and create some projection renders in Blender will also be in the description as well. Gen 1 is coming and this is probably going to change the way we start creating videos. And of course, we've seen some very interesting research from Google, which I would suggest that you look up. And for sure, with a tool like this, old videos will be revised and the way we get to consume videos might change forever. Tell me what you guys think about this one in the comment section. And of course, if you like this video or you like something from this, you can go ahead and give a like and don't forget to share with a friend. And I'd like to see you guys in the next one. Peace.